Hey guys, it's Mel. So long time no video. I have been so busy and I do have to go to work today and tomorrow and the next day and the next day. However, um, I just wanted to do a quick little video uh, while I had some time. Maya's, I mean, Talia's over here playing and Maya's at school. So um, I thought I'd share some fun goodies and kind of catch up. So um, I won't say any spoilers, but I wonder if any of you are Walking Dead fans and have watched that. What? We'll be Peppa Pig. One minute. So, um, I'm wondering if any of you are Walking Dead fans like I am. I, however, have not been a Walking Dead fan from the beginning. Not that I didn't like it. I just didn't understand, um, I guess, why adults would watch zombies, you know, on a show. But it has a whole storyline, and I quick became a, you know a fan as well but I think I didn't start watching until maybe like the fifth season and then I binge watched caught all up and now here I am uh so probably the last two seasons I was on it like a regular fan and prior to that I had to catch up but um I won't say any spoilers but what I will say is that that was that was quite an episode and although the whole Negan thing kind of got on my nerves a little bit because it was like such a you know, back and forth, but I guess that's what it was supposed to be, but it kept you on the edge of your, on the edge of your seat, so, um, if anybody watches it, comment below, I'd love to hear who my fellow fans are, um, so yeah, so just been busy with that, and I'm so tired, Sunday was Maya's Halloween party, it was a, it was a success, so I'm kind of beat, I'm glad that's done, but it's a lot of work having parties for your kids, even if it's just, you know, family and a couple friends, it's, you know, it was, it, it can be a lot like even my family just just my family alone is large so um that can it can be a lot to take care of all those people during a party make sure everybody's happy and do the activities with the kids and and be very involved so and i haven't taken a day off because i've been where i worked that day of the party actually no the day before the party which i should have taken off but i don't like requesting off if i absolutely do not have to so i worked the day before which i could have used that day to prep and then you know kind of did a lot all that morning and the night before and now I've been working every day since so I haven't had a break yet but we'll get there Thursday I'm off so looking forward to Thursday so anyway I got a fun little package and this is my first little package from France so um, I scribbled out my address but I just wanted to show this really pretty font that came on the name this is what the package looked like and it was just fun to receive this is my first package from France so this was fun to receive but yep you see it there France and you see the little um, the little stamp even looks different so that was fun it's a cute little donut stamp so that was cute so you open it up and you get this little business card that says and this was from this is what do you have put mommy's keys back so this is um, lo from lovecynthia.fr is the website. So www.lovecynthia.fr. Um, and then here's just some of her uh, info there. And then that's a little card that says, Hello Love XOXO. And then on here it says, Spread Happiness, Love Cynthia. So just another little card with her, you know, info on there. But um, I saw a YouTuber and uh, she was giving me some of the info. And she she made a lot of, a, a lot larger order and different ones but this is my first one here so i figured i'd try it the shipping wasn't too bad um especially considering that's kind of what you pay for simon says stamp and that is in the u.s the sh my shipping i think was 7.99 for two stamps um to be delivered to where i am um so that's kind of what you pay that see that's understandable when it's coming from france but that's kind of what you pay for maybe one stamp coming from simon says stamp um i that's why i always wait till they have the little coupon i like that they do the coupon there but so it wasn't too bad and it came in this cute little pink bag taped with this little washi here that has some foil in it and i saw maybe because i didn't do such a big order but the person that um the youtuber that i happened to see a video that she made from here uh she got some little washi tape samples i didn't get that but hold on i'm just turning my tv down so i don't know how many of you are moms but my daughter's watching sprout which has the chica which is a little like chick and she just squawks and sometimes you know and I like her she's cute but sometimes it's like that squeaky noise like a dog chew toy on and on and on and on so that got a little loud so I had to turn that down so sorry about that um so that was the bag that it came in and I just got two uh little stamps from her and I'll show you what I got this one I got, and they don't have names on them, so you'll just have to go on the website. But I know some of these, one may be an older one. 
but some of these are from like her latest release and then I think they all sold out and then she just got some more in and that's when I ordered so um, I, they finally came they probably took about two weeks for mine um, to get to me but it was I was still looking forward to them coming so um, it's got this little girl on a swing here I thought she was so cute be awesome today enjoy the adventure it's going to be amazing start each day with a grateful heart and as you see it's like mixed fonts in there this little flower a cute little bunny that you can make her holding like one of the hands or mix it with your other stamps because her her hands up you could even put like flowers in her hands or even balloons from i'll show you my next set and then i love this little girl on the bike and the way she's got her legs out like she's you know trying to be a daredevil i thought that was cute and then this one i didn't see this so you guys will have to tell me what is that in her hand is that a little bunny or is that supposed to be like a curling iron i'm kind of confused at what this is so um those of you who have the stamp or can figure it out tell me what that is it's have some i'm not a coffee drinker does that have something to do with coffee i do not know i can't figure out what that is maybe just a curling iron like she's getting ready in the morning I don't know but that's cute with a little coffee cup minus you know whatever that is but we'll have to figure it out and this one says whatever you are be a good one a little arrow and believe you can so i love that there's sentiments mixed in but these little girls are so cute um some of them i like better than others like some of them that have a side profile i didn't really like for whatever reason i didn't like them so much um but i like these ones but they even have ones that have really short bangs and some family ones there's other ones that i liked but i just had to narrow it down because i didn't want to um spend too much uh on my first order i want to see if i liked them and if they even made it here from france and they did then so, here's the other one and she has a facebook group too that's where i you know i was kind of on there and seeing a lot of people do some really cute things with their planners me with my planner i still use my happy planner but i don't do crazy decorating like i might throw some washi tape in there and maybe some stickers but some people really stamp on there color out all their images um put lawn little girl doing laundry and a little girl going to the doctor and you know whatever your stamps are they really go out but um they're beautiful i just i'd rather put my energies to like cards and um scrapbook layouts because i feel like I, I know some people keep their planners but i feel like after that week's done then that's trash i feel like that's a lot of work so you know more power to you if you can do that but i just feel like i don't, I don't know I, i'd feel sad like my work i guess they keep them and flip through them later but either way they're really cute i just can't i don't know i i wouldn't go back to it so i feel like i would waste all my work um so here is the other one that i got and it's a little girl and she's holding up the bottom of the string and then there's all these alpha that's so fun and you can spell out so many different things um and have like a balloon bunch to s send out a message that um that you like and that's why even this bunny could have a balloon so i'm guessing because there's no string on these you stamp this as high as you want it and then you just continue with a thin pen your string down your balloon strings down from whatever you're spelling out um to do yourself because there's not a balloon stamp in here excuse me a string stamp so um but that's easy enough to do so um so yeah so again i'd love to do that with my planners and uh, make them all pretty and why see there's chica you could probably hear her squawking um <laughs> i turned it down but she seems to get louder and louder um so anyway um again yeah i'd love to try that with my planners but i just i feel bad i feel like they're not going to be seen by enough to or you know even seen by me enough to to put all that work into my planner so i just choose to do it but I, everybody to each their own i choose to do mine via cards and scrapbook layouts and little projects like that so i'm excited to use these so i'll let you know how they stamp out but they feel nice they feel like i don't know anymore with stamps i would i want them to be yeah high quality photopolymer i don't i don't deal with many acrylic stamps because they just don't stamp as nice i guess i got spoiled with like the peachy keen stamps and the paper tray ink yep these are the nice ones so um but i'll i'll tell you for sure when i stamp them out but i just thought i only got these two sets and they're i believe they're 14.99 each so um and then with the shipping so even that to me was pricey for just these two but um that's why i only got two so next time if i like them i'll try some more out but this is what i got for now and then other than that while i have you guys on here i was waiting for i got another order just it's a small little thing from the scrapyard it's been a, i haven't really done that much shopping which is why you haven't seen videos because i haven't had time or you know even been able to so um 
I was going to just save that, but it's really, it's been taking like two weeks to come. So I don't know if I'll have to check on that one. But I got this other one and I was kind of disappointed because it's hard to tell. This was um, off the scrapyard, but it's kind of hard to tell, I guess, sizing and photos. And when this came, I was like, because this was $10 and then it was like 12, I mean, 280 for shipping. So it was like basically $13 as a whole and this is all it is and it's these tiny little dies so uh, I was kind of disappointed at the size of them but um, it's not the person's fault it's just I guess you can't tell you know online that's why it's kind of hard but but look how tiny that little duck is like this little fence I thought it would be bigger to make scene cards and I can still do that and then you know I may I guess tailored expressions dies are pricey to begin with so maybe that's why she priced it so high um, but you know, you do get an amount of dies in here, but they were just a lot smaller than I had pictured. But I guess still small enough to I can use them on card, mix and match. There's a little winter tree, and then uh, you could use that as a fall tree or just an additional tree. There's under this little price thing, there's a bench, a fence, a sitting, uh, well, I guess they're both sitting ducks, but this one's facing up and this one's sitting down, and then a little deer, and what you could use for water for a pond or ice you could use it as ice uh, if you cut it out in white glitter paper it could be used for ice scene so i still want to play with that but i was a little disappointed you know at the size of it but that's what happens when you order online you can't always tell the exact sizes and this one says images smaller than actual size and i couldn't see that in the photo either because it was really just this that you could see and if that's pretty bad if this is this images are smaller than this what they're showing and that's pretty small so but of course in the photo it was like zoomed in so it looked like you know your average size but whatever um so i'll have to try those out and then she just sent a little free stamp with it but speaking of acrylic this was the acrylic one but it was nice so i got this in here so um so yeah, so that one I can either save for a giveaway or, you know, put it in a package for somebody. So those are my goodies. I'll have to let you know, but it probably won't be a while till I have to play with these. But I figured I'd at least share them and show you in case you guys want to check out the website. I haven't stamped them yet, but they do feel like nice uh, photo palm. I'm trying to pick up this card. Nice uh, photo polymer uh, stamps to work with. So those are the two I got, but they have tons of cute ones, a little family one. Um, a little kissy wedding one, um, ones with them cleaning, doing laundry, like if you do want to use them for your planner. Um, so all that type of stuff. So um, check them out. So thank you guys for watching and I'll post more videos soon. Bye.